I thought my son was dead. Becca O'Brien rushed out of her home last Sunday night to find her son, Christopher Mendez, face down in a large pool of blood. She says her son's friend had run inside to ask for help after Christopher hit his head on the ground. I knew it wasn't like a trip and fall. I knew that he was injured really bad. Medics rushed the 17 year old to Nebraska Medicine. They couldn't tell me if he was going to make it, so I thought there was a good chance that we would lose him. She says police are working to learn what led up to the accident while O'Brien watches her son fight for his life in the intensive care unit. It's been devastating and scary. She says he has a traumatic brain injury. Parts of his skull have been removed to allow his brain to swell and he's in a medically induced coma. Originally they were thinking he might only be here for a few months, but now we could be looking at a considerable amount of time into next year. She says her son was hoping to go to culinary school. Now his future is up in the air, but she says he's determined. He has pure unadulterated drive, so I know that he's fighting with everything in him. She calls it a freak accident, but says whatever happened has changed their lives forever. How important it is to be safe and be careful and think twice before you do something that could be dangerous because we're very lucky to have Christopher still. O'Brien says the outpouring of support on social media has been overwhelming. Now, the family has set up a GoFundMe for medical costs as well as caring for Mendez's other siblings. You can find that link at KETV.com. Reporting live in Nebraska Medicine, Sarah Feely, KETV News Watch 7.